Hello, it's Teresa. Here I am. Welcome back. I'm going to use this as a preface for the video, the longer video I did. This is the fully erected tent, Avid Outdoor, if no one's heard about it. They don't exist anymore, at least as far as I can tell. I did some quick research. But I have pretty much a 6x6 six six dome tent, two-person. I think I can find a fly. I didn't have the rain fly. I think I can find one to put on it. And, uh, I lost a clip. And to, uh, you know, make it a complete tent. It's, it's not a complete bust in any way, shape, or form. And it's really windy. You can hear the wind behind me. I have it staked down. Uh, but in an emergency, I think it's going to be a relatively okay $5 tent with the addition of a generic rain flap. And uh, I'm, not, I'm not disappointed. It's fairly easy to put together. I did it by myself. Um, I'm going to apologize now for the weird me showing the length and the width of it. But it just seemed, you know, here's a visual. I'm under five foot. Boom, boom, boom. But uh, it, it came out pretty good. I've, well, I sold it because, yeah, <laughs> it's been in somebody's moldy garage or something. But there's no mold. It's just that. And I'm going to say that when I do my videos, I try to do it in as real life as possible so you guys get the idea of what it takes to put the tent up and everything. So, uh, you know, I, I apologize for the crappy camera work, but you saw it as pretty much in real life as I could. I kind of endeavor to let people see how to do it. Uh, if you don't try, you're not going to learn, you're not going to grow. I'm pretty much not afraid to fail if I'm doing something on my YouTube channel because if I'm an expert, and I'm not, you know, you're going to be like, oh, well, she can do that because she's an expert. I don't want people to think that. It's like, yeah, you know what? Let's throw it out there and see what happens. Um, and I did. Ooh, still downwind. Um, <laughs> Lysol better start working. Um... But that's, that's why you get some of the crazy videos you do. I do it in one shot. It may not, you know, it's going to take me a few minutes to do it. My fire lighting video, perfect example, the ferro rod wouldn't spark. It finally did. But there was good information in there on how to work with the tinder and to stack the sticks, make sure there was airflow and using up cardboard and etc. So this is... This is part of my, you know, video was when I do the self-reliance. I didn't have anybody who could help me do this. If you're in a scenario where you need to put a tent up and there's nobody else, you need to know how to do it by yourself. So I'm going to say look for clippies. Uh, make sure there's a bloody rain uh, flop, but that's, that's how I do my videos. Uh... You know, there's mistakes. I'm honest about it. That way, you know, the learning curve is worth everybody. Some of y'all may be way ahead of me. Some of you may be below, you know, right at my level. But, yeah, this is what I'm doing for it. So, uh, like, subscribe. Yep, this will be the uh, precursor to the very badly videoed uh, tent erection. But, there you go. I'll see you in the next one.